In Ibadan, said the mechanical fault occurred when the lift installation team was working on dismantling the old lift in readiness for a new one. Now, the Secretary of Christian Pilgrims Board, Reverend Yakubu Pam, has described the late Catholic Bishop of Kaduna Diocese, Peter Chetau, as a unifying factor to both Christians and Muslims in northern Nigeria, saying his fatherly advice will be greatly missed. And while the governor of Plateau State was also present at the burial of the late Catholic Bishop, said the Archbishop died where the country truly needed him because of the present security challenges bedeviling the country. On his part, Governor Nasser Erofai was represented by the Commissioner of Internal Security and Home Affairs. Samila Ruan expressed the state government's condolences to the entire northern Nigeria and the country at large over the demise of the Christian cleric, adding that he will be greatly missed. Like somebody said, a silent achiever. And he has great influence on Christians and Muslims both. And uh, his death indeed left a vacuum from both the Catholic fault and Christian believers in Nigeria. We appreciate his counsel. In fact, if there's any time we needed him, it is this time. Because of the challenges that are in our country, the challenges that are even both in Christianity and Islam. Thank God the governor of Kaduna is presented here by my brother, the commissioner. Well, sometimes they say it is when you are there, you see. What you see, they say this, the more you see, the less you understand. We've done our best, we are still doing, uh, doing our best. Well, the first and foremost, what you really need to understand. We are here because we believe in him. We are here and we have also explained uh, most of the things that Kaduna State and the North in general have immensely benefited uh, from him. And I want to assure you that by the special grace of God, we are presently doing social re-engineering. The governor of Plateau State has talked about community policy. It will be recalled that Reverend Dr. Peter died on Wednesday, 16 December 2020, at the age of 88 years, and was laid to rest on Wednesday at St. Joseph Cathedral, Kaduna. In the meantime,